story of Hitler. Welcome to our deep dive into the story of one of history's most notorious figures, Adolf Hitler. Born in 1889, Adolf Hitler grew up in a small town in Austria. He was a high-spirited child, showing early signs of his fiery personality. Hitler aspired to be an artist, a dream his father vehemently opposed. This ignited a rebellious fire in Hitler, shaping the dictator we know today. His life took a turn when he moved to Vienna in pursuit of his artistic ambitions. In Vienna, Hitler experienced homelessness and poverty. He was also exposed to virulent anti-Semitism, which would later form the basis of his ideology. This period was pivotal in forming Hitler's worldview and political beliefs. Hitler joined the German Workers' Party in 1919. This party was later rebranded as the National Socialist German Workers' Party, or the Nazi Party. Hitler quickly ascended the ranks, thanks to his powerful oratory skills and charismatic personality. Hitler's first attempt at seizing power was in the form of a failed coup, the Beer Hall Putsch in 1923. This landed him in prison, where he wrote his infamous book, Mein Kampf, outlining his political ideology and plans for Germany. After his release, Hitler dedicated himself to legality and winning power through elections. The economic crisis of the 1930s provided a fertile ground for his nationalist and anti-Semitic propaganda, leading to the Nazis becoming the largest party in the German parliament in 1933. Hitler was appointed chancellor in 1933. He swiftly began transforming the democratic Weimar Republic into a totalitarian Nazi state, consolidating his power through a series of laws, purges, and intimidation tactics. One of Hitler's first acts was the Enabling Act, which gave him the power to enact laws without the involvement of the Reichstag. This marked the beginning of his dictatorship, enabling Hitler to control every aspect of German life. Hitler re-armed Germany in direct violation of the Treaty of Versailles. His expansionist policies led to the annexation of Austria and the Sudetenland in Czechoslovakia, setting the stage for World War II. Hitler's aggressive foreign policy and disregard for international treaties led to the Second World War in 1939. He saw the war as a means of achieving his dream of a racially pure German Empire. Hitler's reign of terror was marked by the Holocaust, the systematic genocide of six million Jews. The horror and scale of this atrocity remain unparalleled in human history. The turning point of World War II came with the invasion of the Soviet Union in 1941. Hitler's plan to conquer the living space for the Germans ended up stretching his resources thin and led to a series of military defeats. The Holocaust reached its peak during this period. Hitler's final solution led to the extermination of millions of Jews in concentration and extermination camps across Europe. By 1944, Hitler's dream of a German empire was crumbling. The Allies were closing in on Germany, and Hitler's health was deteriorating. Hitler's dogmatic insistence on holding ground led to unnecessary losses and further weakened the German military. In April 1945, as Allied forces encircled Berlin, Hitler retreated to his bunker. With the end imminent, he married his longtime companion, Eva Braun. In a final act of defiance and unwillingness to be captured, Hitler and Braun committed suicide on April 30, 1945. Their bodies were later found by his aides, marking the end of one of history's most infamous tyrants. Hitler left behind a legacy of destruction and horror. His aggressive policies resulted in the death of millions and left Europe in ruins. After the war, the world vowed never again. The United Nations was founded to maintain international peace and security, and to prevent such atrocities from happening in the future. The story of Hitler serves as a stark reminder of the dangers of unchecked power and racial hatred. It illustrates how an ideology of hate can lead to unimaginable horrors. The story of Hitler is also a lesson in the importance of democratic checks and balances. 
It shows us how crucial it is to safeguard our institutions from those who aim to undermine them. In conclusion, Adolf Hitler, a man driven by a perverse ideology and unbridled ambition, plunged the world into a war that claimed millions of lives and changed the course of history forever. Today, as we remember the victims of the Holocaust, we are reminded of the importance of tolerance, understanding and peace. The story of Hitler serves as a chilling warning against the destructive power of hate, one that the world must never forget.